Hey everyone, and welcome back to the Eat Me Cooks channel. We've been getting a lot of snow here, so we decided to share our chicken pot pie recipe, a simple and timeless dish for these cold days. Send this recipe to your family and friends to keep them warm after being out in the chilly weather. Now let's get right into the video. So the ingredients for this recipe are two chicken breasts, olive oil, two teaspoons of salt, one teaspoon of pepper, half an onion, one carrot, one cup of parsley, one stick of butter, three fourth cups of flour, five cups of chicken stock, pastry dough, and one egg. We'll start off with our chicken breast. Get a baking tray and line it with aluminum foil. Spread out some olive oil and place your chicken on the tray. Season each side with salt and pepper. Then we'll place them into our preheated convection oven at 350 degrees for 20 to 25 minutes. While our chicken bakes in the oven, we'll begin prepping our vegetables and herbs. We'll dice our onion and chop our carrots into nice chunks. We'll also give our parsley a rough chop. Now we'll head over to our stove and put a pot on medium heat. Add in a stick of butter, and once it's melted, we'll add in our onions and let them cook for a few minutes until they soften up. Once soft, we'll add in our flour, which will act as a thickening component. Mix the flour thoroughly with the buttered onions. Now add in the chicken stock and season the mixture with salt and pepper. Give it a stir and let the stock boil. By now our chicken should be done Take it out of the convection oven and give it a few minutes to cool. When the chicken has cooled, dice them into nice chunks like so and take it over to the stove. Back at the stove, we can preheat our oven to 400 degrees. In the pot, add in chopped carrots, parsley, and chicken. You can also add in other vegetables, such as peas. Mix the ingredients together and turn off the heat. Now that our filling is done, we'll work on our pastry dough. Flour your work surface and place your dough down. Add another generous layer of flour on top to prevent it from sticking to the rolling pin and roll out your dough. For this recipe, I wanted to make sure that there was enough pastry dough to cover two chicken pot pies. Once the dough is rolled out to our liking, get a large bowl to use as a guide for cutting out the shape. Feel free to use any other items. Just make sure that the item you're using is bigger than the ramekins so that the dough covers the chicken pot pie nicely. Now we can take our ramekins and place in our mixture. In a separate bowl, beat one egg to use as an egg wash. We'll use our fingers or a brush to gently paint the rims of the ramekin with the beaten egg. Place on the pastry dough and seal the sides. We'll also take our egg wash and brush the top as well. This allows our dough to bake properly. 
We'll then take our ramekins to our oven. Let them bake at 400 degrees Fahrenheit for about 30 to 35 minutes. Once they're done, you'll see that the dough transformed into a beautiful dome. Our dish will be hot, so be careful when handling. Carve a hole into the middle of the pastry topping and serve like so. And there you have it! A simple and delicious homemade chicken pot pie that will melt off the winter snow. If you haven't already, please drop a like if you enjoyed this video and share it with your family and friends. Subscribe if you are new and hit that bell icon so you never miss any future recipes. You can also follow us on Instagram at Eat Me Cooks. We upload a new recipe every Friday. Thanks for tuning in to the Eat Me Cooks channel. We'll catch you guys in the next one. Stay full.